All right, and we are back playing some Spore. So, welcome back. In the last episode, we just finished updating uh, Kleeborb. And now we are finishing trying to survive, stay alive, find some food. Oh, I'm fast now, like, this is crazy. Oh, oh yeah, chomp that for me. Got that for me. So much easier when you're fast. Oh, that was one of the big guys I tried to kill earlier. Oh, what's this? A brain? A cell with the brain? Congratulations, you are you are on the path to sentience. When it comes to swimming in sludge, you rule the pool. When you are ready to stretch your legs in the big wide open, click the advance button. So that is this button right down her. And looks like if I really want to, I have one more cell part to collect. And you know what? I just might. I just might do that. So I hope you guys don't mind me flying around or swimming around. I don't think I collect any more DNA at this point. No. But there is one guy, and I think it's this guy, who has the proboscis, the, uh, the mosquito mouth, which is very handy for the uh yeah see it just ah oh, that poor keyboard oh can get him come on get him get him there we go and I got it oh now I gotta run away Discus. Those guys are quite hard. Holy Moses. There we go. Alright. So, Probiscus. The little straw tube mouth. And then we get onto the fun stuff. So, goodbye, carnivore. Goodbye, that. And Probiscus mouth. Man, I could only give him one more. That'd be nice. All right, and so final evolution, I guess. It's one we haven't done. Yeah, that's an interesting one. Let's go with pink. Nope, just regular old pink. Yep. Yeah, it's pretty creepy looking. Alright, so we are going to evolve, grow some legs. Oh, hello, Cleaboard. Actually, I want to show you how this proboscis thing works real quick. If I can find something. Yeah, let, yeah that guy should be good. I can just, see, just suck it right up. Like a straw. Leaves the body. Yep, that's good. Alright. Oh. And legs. 
So, timeline. This timeline shows a history of the actions you have taken during life as a cell. You have established a trait which earns you unique abilities that will benefit your future gener generations. Which path have you chosen? Um, I killed a lot of things. So, I'm going to say carnivore. Generation 1, all the way down. Alright. Oh, yeah, I ate a lot. Killed 311. Damn. 11. Alright, so. As a cell, let's grow some legs. Alright, so that's what he looks like right now. I have 65. DNA points, I guess. Thundercalf, Fatella, Brontosaurus, Bronisaurus. Let's go, uh, let's give you some Thundercalf legs. Actually, let's, uh, let's make you really weird looking. Which I'll get into a little bit later. But, uh, I'm gonna put some eyes up there by his legs. Like I said, this game, you can do some crazy craziness. And let's move this down. Yep. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, what did I just do? Stitches. Let's give them feathery type looking things. Let's make it like that. some really ugly spots. Ridiculous, man. Just ridiculous. All right, and let's. Uh, since we got a bunch of different things, and we still got some. I'm gonna do that and jump as well. Might as well just give you some jump. Absolutely. 
ridiculous. I fucking love it. Oh my goodness. Get out of here. Reticulating spines. Animation variances. So creature stage um, is a little bit more complicated than the cell phase or the amoeba phase. Um, so you actually have to go kind of Almost evolve and kind of define what kind of creature you're gonna be for the next phase. So, but those guys just run so ridiculous. Oh my god, I love it. Oh, I love it. It is the beginning of a new day, and for you, a whole new strange and wondrous world. Air fills your lungs as you stretch into your limbs in your new home, dry land. The race to evolve has begun. Now you are a creature surrounded by nestmates. To evolve, you will need to meet the other species on this planet and earn DNA. Earning DNA moves your progress blah, bar, blah, blah, blah. Yep, you guys know where that is already. The goals. I'm an omnivore, so eat fruit or meat. And collect new parts. Okay, so right camera to move around. And left click to move. Oh, I can eat. Alright, well it looks like I already did that and there's that. Alright, so there's these little question marks down here, which is unknown species. So we are going to go let's go meet this neighbor over here. Not very agile, is he? Oh. What are you, the little guy? You've met a new species. Care to make them a friend or foe? Set your stance and get ready to sing or snarl at your newfound neighbor. Okay. So, stances. Before you interact, click on the green button to make friends or the red button to make dinner. All right, down there. Special ability is Raging Roar. So we are going to make this guy a friend. So green button is clicked. Now we are right click on him. Or left click. All right, and he wants to sing. We have sing. So, bam. We are singing fools. Singing fools. All right, and it says I need to Impress two more of those little guys to make them my friends. So hopefully they just want to sing some more. Singing is easy. Singing is easy. You guys are like little scorpion bell butts. Oh, I messed it up. I messed it up. I scared you. I scared you. Singing. Oh, but I didn't have enough. Okay, so real quick. So reward for impressing the three of these is 25 DNA. If I go to attack, it's only 20. So I want my 25. There we go. Alright, so now I got 55 total. Locate my mate. Where you at, woman? There you are. And it's double click, double left click to move. And making some babies. Oh. That is just, that is too funny. I, I I can't look at these guys anymore. It is just it's it's too much to look at these guys the way they are. So 
we are going to take off our thing and redo it all. Oh, nothing but a, a skeleton. All right, so let's down. Now you need a mouth. Oh, oh, uh-oh. Oh, we are undoing a whole lot of stuff. I need to have my proboscis mouth because neither of these are omnivore mouths. Eyes back there, that's pretty crazy. Take you anymore? Okay. Oh, yep, a little tail. Do we really need four eyes? first. We need legs. So, we need to have something other than just sink and bite. Um, so let's see. Got charge. Charm level two. Charm and sneak. Charm and sneak, jump, charm. And we'll go with the palm tom. We'll, uh, we'll give you some palms on your little wiggly waggly tail. Not bad. It's interesting. Let's see, I got 50 more points. Dance. Dance would be good. Dance two, sneak two, speed one. That's like. Forty-five more points. Should we give him another mouth for bite two? Because he only has bite one, and in case I get attacked, no, no, no. Two, strike two. Yeah, we'll need that. So let's. Yeah, we'll put things on your tail. We like things on your tail, don't we? Kind of make you like a little scorpion almost. Yeah. 
scorpion-like. Alright, and I think that's it, unless I feel like doing more eyes. Yeah, that's it. Alright, Cleeborbs. We are going to call it here for today, and we will see you in the next episode. Thanks for hitting that subscription button. Thanks for watching that thumbs up button. Like I said previously, I love this game. It's so much fun. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. It's, uh, it's a good change of pace from Dreadnought and Assassin's Creed. So we will see you next time.